Hey YouTube, it's ICU, and today we're going to be taking a look at the new connector on Apple's iPhone 5 and also comparing its transfer speeds against the old standard 30 pin connector. All right, so here we go. We have the lightning connector on the right and the old 30 pin connector on the left. There is a significant difference and it's even smaller than the USB end of the cable itself. So we have a huge difference here between the old standard, the 30 pin connector and the new standard, the lightning connector, which has eight gold pins. Now, when looking at the ports, it also makes a huge difference and it definitely conserves on how much real estate it actually takes up. All right, so let's go ahead and look at the connector and how we insert it. So it does work both ways because it has pins on both sides whereas the previous connector would only work one way. Okay, now we're going to be taking a look at the transfer speeds because even though it is USB 2.0, Apple claims that it is lightning fast and it's faster than the old 30 pin connector, which is also USB 2.0. So I did start up a speed test here between the two. It's transferring the exact same file from the same computer using the same USB port one is the iPhone 4S on the left, and the other one is the iPhone 5 with the new lightning connector on the right. So we are transferring the same file, it's just a video file, and it is 1.22 gigabytes. All right, and as you can see, the iPhone 5 did finish first with a total of 45.2 seconds, and the iPhone 4S came in second place with a total of 49.7 seconds. All right, and as you can see, the files are indeed on both iPhones. So the iPhone 5 with the new lightning connector does offer a slightly faster transfer speed than the old 30 pin connector. So I hope you guys like this video. Please be sure to rate it up, leave your comments down below in the comment section, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button to be notified every time I release new videos. And until next time, this is ICU signing out.